White Sox trying to bounce back after being swept in Detroit this past weekend. Samuel Deduno going for the Twins. Bottom two, he runs into Gordon Beckham with a man on. That ball hit hard. Stay in the air. He goes back, looks up. You can put it on the board. Yes! Just a line shot out of here. And our Sox lead it 2-0. Now they're 13 on the season for Beckham. Hector Santiago has pitched out of the bullpen this year for the White Sox. Here making his first major league start, and he was more good than bad. And the fourth inning puts down Josh Willingham, Justin Morneau as well. Santiago with six strikeouts. Top five, though. He serves one up to Jamie Carroll. Carroll had gone 1,348 at-bats without a home run. That was the longest active streak in the bigs. Lasted over three years. Bottom seven, Paul Canerco gets one back. The RBI single that plates Kevin Euclid, and it's 3-1 White Sox. Paul Canerco, he could do it all for them. Go down to the bottom of the eighth inning. Gordon Beckham at it again. The RBI single that brings in Alexei Ramirez. Beckham with three RBIs from the nine hole. And the White Sox able to take a 4-2 lead. Ninth inning, potential tying run at the plate. And Addison Reed battling with Alexi Casilla. Take your time. And back them up. This bowl game is over. Over it is. White Sox win 4-2. 25th save for Reed. Santiago earns his third win. Six relievers combined to throw four innings of one-run ball for the Pale Hose. And combined with the Tigers' loss, the White Sox are back in first, one game ahead of Detroit in the Central.